Hello, this video is about Skype. What is Skype? At the end of my messages, my email messages, I always type the word, if you want to get in contact with me, Skype me. And it never occurred to me that a lot of people don't know what Skype is. So I wanted to share with you because this is something that I think everyone who is on the internet or who has a PC should have for a couple of reasons. Number one, it's totally free. And number two, if another person that you want to speak with also has Skype, it doesn't matter where they are in the world, you too can speak from Skype to Skype, either via chat or speaking, like talking to each other using Skype absolutely free. Okay, so it's very much like um, MSN Messenger or Yahoo Messenger or Instant Messenger, but it has a couple of more advanced features. So what you're going to do is just go to your web browser to download Skype into your computer. And you're going to go to just um, Skype.com and this homepage here will come up just like you see it here. And uh, we're going to keep this really simple, but uh, what you're going to do is you're going to download your Skype and once you do it, you will see it on a corner on your computer and you will double click on it and it'll give you a list of your contacts if you have any or not. And then you can double click any one of those. We're going to do that next so that you can see exactly what that looks like. But first, let me show you a couple things that you can do with Skype. You can send and receive voicemails. You'd have to set that up. So they have a lot of different options. But the most important one that I want to bring up to your attention is um, the free service, the Skype to Skype, which is what I pretty much communicate with uh, with most of my international customers. Here's one thing that I found um, really, really useful with Skype is that you go to the share and you can actually add a button to your websites letting people know that you are available via Skype. It automatically um, knows that you are on there. Just see here where it says buttons and widgets. Okay, just click on that and <clears throat> click on create a Skype me button now. This is really cool. I, I love this program. I'm surprised that they offer it for free, but you know, it's uh, it's the way of the internet right now, you know, communication and making it easier for people to communicate. So see that button right there? It's kind of what it looks like on my websites too, but you can enter your Skype name. For example, mine is A. Buchanan. Okay. And then I, let's say that I want to add a button to my website that it flashes, you know, I want it to flash. Okay. So you can pick a static button or one that flashes. I like the flashy one. So I'll select this button here and then it goes and it generates the code for you. So all you have to do is copy and paste this code into your website, or you can actually copy and paste this code into an email. So if you want to sign your emails with your Skype button, you can do that too, instead of typing your Skype name. So that's kind of cool. I use that a lot. Another thing you can use, another thing that you can use for your websites, which is really neat, and I haven't actually used this yet. I've just seen it used. Is you can actually generate a chat room right in your website. Now you need access to the HTML of your website for this, um, but you can take those widgets also that the same place where we were at, where you saw the widgets, buttons and widgets here. And see where it says public chat snippets. Okay. You can actually create a public chat right on your website so that if people are visiting the website, instead of clicking on that Skype me button, they can actually just start typing and um, it'll alert you that you have a chatter and then you can go to your page and chat with that person. Um, here's where you would go on there. And then the benefit of that is that if there are other people visiting that page right at the same uh, moment, then they will see the chat going on and they might join and um, partake in the conversation or what have you. So, you know, this is just some of the ways to download the chat room and, and what it'll look like, but they have, as you can see, different uh, colors. So this is a very nice, easy way to, if you wanted to offer your visitors a chat room right in your page and it generates the code for you. And, you know, you can read all about how to do that here. But the most important thing I would take from this is um, the Skype 
program allows you to speak directly with other people who also have Skype for free anywhere in the world. So it's a really nice feature to offer on your website or on your in your emails to your customers. So hopefully that helps you. Let me show you really quickly what Skype. So once you have Skype installed, you'll see a little icon that you can double click and this is what it looks like. You enter your Skype name that you selected and your password and you click on sign in. Okay, so this is my Skype window. You can see all my contacts here. You can actually uh, edit your profile to have a link to your website next to your name so people can see that if they have you on their contact list. And uh, as you can see, it'll show you much like many other um, instant message systems, the status of the different people. And you can learn about what those statuses mean, but they're pretty self-explanatory. And uh, for any person that you have on your Skype, you can click on their um, name and you can either chat with them by type by clicking this blue chat button or you can actually call them. Let's give Mike Hobbs a call really quick and see. Hello, this is Mike. Hi Mike. How are you? Hi Mike. This is Aime. How are you? I'm good, good. How are you? I'm I'm doing fine. I'm actually recording a video on how to use Skype and I picked your name and thought I'd give you a call and say hello. Awesome. Good. Good. Now everybody can see how well and how easy Skype can work. And uh, I'm actually in Arizona and Mike is in Utah. So we can talk like this for free. And you can talk like this with anyone in the world for free that has Skype. But anyway, I'll let you go, Mike, and I'll talk to you real soon. Have a great day. You too. Okay, bye-bye. You just click on this red button here and you end your call. I think that maybe he wasn't expecting that, but um, Mike and I have uh, have uh, been working together for a long time, so hopefully it was okay that I included him in the video. And uh, you can do that with just about anybody. So also, like I said before, you can um, actually make a phone call to somebody that is not on your contact list, and what you would do is uh, you can... Um, check the country where they're at and it'll dial the code for you directly and then you just uh, open your tab up here where it says call phones okay this is the country that i selected and you can either punch in or enter the number of the person that you want to call just like that okay here's a format and then press uh, the green button and it dials them these are the calls that will cost you money though so just so that you know but uh, from skype to skype is completely um, free so that's all i wanted to cover about skype and i encourage you to download it just go to skype.com where we were at before here and uh, go to the download link right there and download your Skype. You can personalize it all you want and then uh, give me a call. Add me to your Skype and add me to your contact list. My Skype name is A. Buchanan and you can find that in my emails or on my website and um, give me a call. Let me know how you're doing and uh, we'll stay in touch that way and if you ever have any questions about any of the video tutorials that I send then that'll be a quick and easy way for you to ask me questions and uh, if I am available then I'll be there and uh, to answer your questions and that's a fast and easy way to stay in touch with people so you can replicate and share Skype with uh, all your contacts as well. So I'll talk to you soon and have a great day.